Hey guys, just a little heads up. I'd really appreciate if you went and check out part one that I did of this. Um, I am actually out in Germany at the moment, so I don't really have um, time to annotate and things like that. But I hope you guys um, go ahead and check out part one. And if, of course, you need any sort of coins, check out battelay.com. Make sure you use my discount code down below. Hope you all have a great day, and I hope you get a goddamn legend in your packs. Enjoy the video. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, and I hope you guys um, have tuned in, maybe you've just come straight from part one, um, if you guys haven't already checked out part one, I talked about uh, a bit of the England performances recently, as well as uh, what I'm doing over in Germany, so uh, make sure you guys go ahead and watch part one before you continue on to part two, but we're just going to kind of drain out these FIFA points, and uh, obviously legends are still out, maybe I should actually show you guys the legends, I'll do it after this... Uh after this particular um, pack, but I just want to kind of briefly go over them. I went in a little bit more detail on the last one, so go ahead and check that out. But I'll oh, see, say, man, that's not who I'm wanting. Uh, I'll take the fitness one. I've got so many consumables just because of the amount of packs I've been opening is ridiculous. And it kind of, I, I discard a lot of players that most people, I guess, would kind of keep. And I would recommend you keep, keep a lot of stuff in your packs. Um, I guess I'm just way too lazy and I open way too many packs for it to become even more. I don't even know why I just clicked on my active squad but there you go i'm rocking the bird camp i want to be able to somehow get this combo going here but uh, yeah i guess that's a little bit of a spoiler so um i'll leave that but i was actually meant to go and show you guys the um well this is the team of the week we'll quickly take a look at the um uh, we'll get a look at the team. I mean, let's be honest, guys. There's only a few players here that I'm really interested in. My man Sacco here, who is a monster. Um, we also got, of course, Big Ronnie. And then we got Jean Moutinho. So that's the team of the week. Um, a few silver players. I really, ha really haven't been interested in silver players this year. Um, or bronze, for that matter. Uh, a little bit better than last year, though. You know, I just didn't enjoy um, silvers whatsoever last year. Whereas this year, I'm just... You know, I'm just haven't haven't uh, messed around with them. Where am I? Uh, there we go. Here, the Legends Challenge. Remember, there's 42, so I'm pretty sure there might be a few missing from here. But uh, yeah, so we got these big guys here, Zola. You know, just so many. I don't want to go through them all again. You guys are probably well aware. You guys can check this out on your own console too. So those are the Legends. Let's get straight back into this pack opening because let's let's look at those few points. We need to drain those bad boys out, son. And uh, oh my God, what am I doing? I keep pressing all the wrong things. You guys are probably like, "Wow, when's he actually gonna get to the pack opening?" Jesus. And um, as you guys can see, I don't know if you guys saw that, but someone in the top right just got a gullet. I can't tell whether he bought that or he got that in a pack. Oh, I might have to uh, drop a message afterwards because that's pretty filthy. Anyways, uh, pack opening. Dun, 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 golden ball of goodness. Spits out a wild... Oh, De Jong. Ugh. Hey, he could uh, possibly partner up with my man uh, Burkamp at the top there. But uh, yeah, I want to try this Larson Ebra combo. That's just going to be so filthy. Get that left wing back. But besides that, everyone else is getting that discard sausage. And we move swiftly onwards. Uh, but yeah, we got, I think that was Honda in the front. I, I, for some reason, guys, and you know, feel free to slap me around in the comments a little bit for it. But for some reason, I had it in my mind that it was Kagawa for so, so long. Oh my god, Ray says no. I swear to you, I'm not. But... Um, you know, it's just, I, I, I don't know why I had it in my mind that it was Kago, but it is Honda. So, um, yeah, discard these bad boys. I've got just over a million coins as well. It was from my huge pack opening, so I might actually go ahead and buy myself a legend card. Um, I want to talk a bit about the release of the legend cards, actually. Um, a lot of it, in my opinion, was very controversial, and I'm not one to necessarily stir the pot. You guys know I like to kind of stay out of, uh, all that sort of stuff as much as possible, but, you know... What I found very interesting was with EA when they release these packs, uh, when they sorry when they release these legends, for the first hour and a half there was not a single legend on the market. Now, from my understanding and from what um, several EA employees tweeted as well, was that these players were going to be rare and you know the best ones, the ones like uh, Pele etc. They are going to be extremely rare. Okay, and uh, you know, I was completely on board with that But what they also said was that some of the lower tier players are actually not gonna be as rare as you may think In fact, they're going to be you know not common But you know there should there should be no shortage of them if that makes sense You know, they're definitely gonna be more accessible to your sort of uh, not everyday player But you know, they're not gonna be ridiculously price hiked pretty much anyways That's kind of besides the point so they were gonna be relatively available now not a single legend card gets put on the market for the first hour and a half, guys. And I don't know about you, but the, the second inform Ronaldo, there was one on the market in the first 15 minutes. And it just felt really strange. I, 
I kind of want to say now it's gone out of a big way to accuse EA of not actually putting them in packs for the first hour and a half but something was messed up maybe the weights of them were messed up or something like that but honestly anyone who is on Twitter will know that it was a complete shambles and it was actually really kind of a a bad mess. I mean, I, pers I personally think they messed up some weights and things like that because uh, after about that hour and a half marker, next thing you know, they just start appearing on the market like it's nothing. You know, you, you get one, you get two, you get three, you get four, or five, six, seven. And I was just a bit like, whoa, okay, you know, is it like in the space of 30 minutes, uh, like 10 have been put up but in the first hour and a half not a single one got put up it just seemed a little bit strange let me know you guys thoughts in the comments i'd love to hear what you have to say of course you know i'm not accusing anyone of everything it just all seemed really weird and a little bit messed up so i'd love to hear what you have to say and trust me guys plenty of people were opening packs in those first hour and a half including a few of the people that i'm in a call with and uh, you know there was just uh yeah that's just the case with that but um the very first card to be put up was a de de, Bo de boer God damn my pronunciation. I hate it. I hate the fact that I suck at it. But anyways, you guys, uh, he, he went for something like 2.5 million, guys, for the very first one. Now he doesn't even go for a million. But that's just a prime example. You know, when something just comes out on the market and, you know, it's something completely brand new, people pay redonkulous amounts. And now the person who bought that must be feeling like a right twat you know having to spend 2.5 million and now he's worth under a million a day later you know so kind of that's a that's a not a lesson because you guys aren't kids by any means but you know that's something to keep in mind is that it if you just wait, a lot of the times things will just end up, price will drop, and you can often save so many coins just by holding on. And that's why I haven't necessarily gone ahead and picked up any sort of uh, uh, players just yet. Most of the ones have actually be, just been borrowed to me, unfortunately. Um, I'd love to have my own one at some point, but I really want to get my own one in a pack, because getting it in a pack is just absolutely sweet. But I get Isco there, that's pretty decent. Uh, Mascherano, just that discard, the high life. And then we're just going to open up one last final pack, guys. Thank you very much for watching these packs openings like I said I am in uh, Germany at the moment so I can't reply to too many comments and things but that doesn't mean I'm not reading them uh, so please guys uh, just go ahead leave a comment leave me what your thoughts on the whole uh, fiasco of the release of legends were uh, I I'm very interested to hear what you guys have to say hope you guys have a cracking day and I'll catch you guys in just a little bit and that was a fucking awful pack to end it on I'll see you guys in just a bit bye bye